Yo, what's good? Welcome back to another podcast, Elevated Podcast. We're back with another one. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe on other videos and shit. Let us know what y'all niggas think about the other videos down below. Yo, we got, we got, um, what's his app called? We got Threads now. Right. So, let, right. so, that's what we're going to be talking. We're going to be interacting with the with, with our supporters and shit, man. Let us know what we want to talk about in the next podcast. Mm -hmm. If there's anything y'all niggas want to talk, just discuss about shit so we can, like, build the fan base stronger. We're going to be posting anything that every, anything and anything that comes in mind because I don't think there's no restrictions. Is there any restrictions <laughs> it's on It's the same shit as Instagram, so I don't, I don't really know, bro. Is there restrictions on threads? I don't know. It's new, so probably not. It better not be restrictions, because that's what we missing, feel me? Like, Twitter, it's like Twitter kind of, feel me? What you feel about the app, though, feel me? Let's talk about that. The app? We, what, you, what you feel about the app? I'm not going to. I just downloaded that shit, bro. The app might not be there for that long, because Elon is talking about um, pressing charges and shit. Yo, this shit. nigga Elon is, 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 bro, he's ruining everything, bro. You don't think that, bro? This nigga is coming in trying to change everything, bro. I mean, think about the nigga that he just bought the company, Twitter, and then now nigga um, Mark want to come out with some shit that's just like his yeah, shit. Yeah, they be competing, bro. Yeah, you gotta, I, I this nigga that. Elon is, he's down money from just buying that shit. Yeah, oh, yeah. Uh, Twitter. Yeah, you down no, wait, money. You, using that shit. It, you feel me? No, yeah, yeah, that's a fact, though, because Matthew from Twitter is going to threads now. Yeah, and, you know I mean? and he's restricting that shit so much, like... The Twitter, right? Yeah, yeah, Twitter. Mad porn yeah. and shit began to take it down. Oh, no, nah, he's bugging. Can't be What's wrong with Elon, bro? You act like you don't watch porn. Weird. Nah, it be up sometimes, but, like, a lot of accounts got restricted. Like, the big, wow. big, the big accounts would be, be getting, like, restricted. But and shit. let's not make threads into, like, Twitter, though, bro. Let's not, bro, <laughs> relax. You don't got to put a sex tape. Twitter before, back in the day, like, when I was seeing one, when, when people be telling me, like, niggas just posting everything. It's like Facebook. I'm not gonna lie, Facebook's always still here. It's, it's, it, I don't know, bro. <laughs> not only they don't fuck up Facebook, it's Gucci, because Facebook nah. can post anything. Nah, shit. bro. Facebook used to be worse, bro. You can't really post that. Yeah, I you got can't post shit. Yeah, you can't post before, shit. Bro. Oh, yeah, yeah. I got, <laughs> oh, yeah, I got restricted masks on. They used to be putting live photos, and then it would be just bare cheeks. Niggas oh, yeah, getting yeah, yeah, clapped yeah, yeah, and yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> okay. Yo, good times, bro. That nah, changed right. after COVID, bro. That nah, changed after right. COVID. Niggas stopped doing that shit. But I think Threads is, for me, if Threads don't have no restrictions, on that shit, bro. For me, it'll be a good app. I like that. If there's no restrictions, bro. Mm -hmm. If it's restrictions, the app is corny, bro. We're not on there anymore. Yeah, for me, but like, Threads is a good app. So if so, anybody watching this, y'all wanna catch up? We're gonna be posting on Threads like every day, hopefully, if we can and shit. Anything, anything. Don't me. forget to add the Facebook. I mean, follow the Facebook. Oh yeah, and the Facebook. Instagram yeah, facts, facts. TikTok, not yeah. really. They they too restrictive, bro. Niggas bro. keep taking down the fucking sound of our videos. Bro. So. Yeah, You're not even not, saying nothing. Yeah. Did we say anything bro, bad? You can't episode? curse at all, bro. Oh, cursing. You can't curse at all, bro. Hey, I'm not gonna lie, bro. Yo, if we can't curse and do this podcast, niggas is not doing this podcast, bro. I, I'm gonna keep it a buck, bro. Like, son, it's a part of vernacular. I've been bro. trying to keep it down um, to a minimum, bro. bro. It's our but vernacular, that's in general, bro. bro. That's in general. If bro. it's a discussion, bro, we get to discussion, bro. It gets heated, bro. Niggas is gonna curse, bro. That's it's, it's, it's second nature, bro. Mm -hmm. See, that's what's going on with. See, bro, I'm not gonna lie. That's the one thing I don't like about the podcast, bro. Right now, bro. Cause I feel like niggas don't got that much like create creativity, bro. I don't feel like niggas can really be themselves. If niggas got got hold up to a certain guideline, bro, what's the point of podcasting, bro? For me, it wasn't like this before. I mean, everybody's bro. hold up to a certain. That shit, I don't like that though, bro. That's everybody's what I'm saying. Up to That's what I'm saying. So like, if it's getting too restricted, bro. <clears throat> Like you saying niggas gotta be how the fuck are we supposed to have a normal, genuine conversation? That's not that's not how it works, bro. So I, so I doubt it, bro. Me personally, this podcast, bro, we probably not gonna do that, bro. So nigga, like, as long as our shit stay up, we goosey, bro. For me, but like if you know our shit gone for some reason, you know why, bro. <laughs> niggas not conforming to the to the fucking guidelines, bro. We're not doing that, bro. Right. But yeah, bro. But follow us on some threads and shit, but yo, we about to talk about it. We got shit to talk about, feel me? Um, YMW Melly and shit, man. This nigga been on trial for like a year now, right? Nah, it's, it's, it's been more. I think he, More than you? Like, like two or some shit. I know he been locked for a minute, though. It was, I think it was like a year after he, this nigga got hot. It's been for a minute, though. Ah, yeah. No, his trial just started. His trial just started. Oh, his trial just yeah, started. Yeah, yeah. But that nigga been locked for a minute, bro. Son is, <coughs> uh, is uh, is, uh, is, he's accused of killing both his mans. You Double feel murder. Me? Double murder, you feel me? And they they got a video of him coming out the same vehicle yeah, and yeah. shit. Yeah, this nigga could be cooked, bro, but <laughs> we don't know. But, like, his defense is that he didn't do it, obviously. That's his defense. He didn't do it and shit. Um, I don't know. The internet, I didn't really look up to my case and shit, but from what I'm seeing the internet, they trying to say, like, this nigga might get old, though. Nah, he... Nah, I've been seeing that a lot. It's a good chance. That's, but, the, but, like, with the witness now, they don't know. Oh, see? See, the witness. But with witness. the witness now, they don't know. But before, it was looking like a nigga was going to get old. That's why he was laughing. 
in yeah. the fucking um, courtroom and shit. I seen that nigga laughing. I'm smart, not gonna say, shit, bro, bro, nigga did it, but like, I'm not gonna lie. Nigga is too happy for being on a trial that niggas accusing him of killing both his mans, in my opinion. I mean, you gotta fake it till you make it, bro. No, that's what I'm saying. To, for him to be innocent, he's really too more happy than mm. I would be. I would be angry if I was on a trial and I know I didn't and kill my man. And you know you didn't do it? Yeah. I, like, I would be mad. Especially if it's my mans, I would yeah, be Yeah, I feel, tight, I feel what you're saying. You feel, like, you feel like him being mad happy, it means like he just thinking about himself. He's not really remorseful that his mans yeah, died. Yeah. So it's kind of like alluding to like he probably did it because he's the one that did it and shit. Because, <laughs> bro, because it was, I heard some shit talking about like, oh, the reason why he did it because his mans just extorted him and shit so he had to do it. But you still killed him, though, bro. Nah, for me, that's still crazy. Nigga, that's not self-defense, you heard. Even though he in Florida, though, you could probably use that. But I don't think it's no I fucking, don't think it was self-defense. You know, it's no fucking shit. I think, so. he, I think they rolled up on them niggas. Oh, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, nigga Melly weird, too, bro. What would you do, though, like, if your mans, like, yeah, yeah. y'all in a group, and one of your mans, like, supposedly killed them, and, like, you seeing like you adding the shit up, but you was actually like you woke up in the same um, house. The nigga changed his clothes and rushing out and shit the same day. Everybody is supposedly happening and shit. Damn. And like you have that information. You watch Juice. And right? you know that like all the um the like the beef between all of them and shit. You watch Juice, right? Yeah. I'm gonna be like Q, bro. I don't want to do. What the fuck I'm supposed to do, bro? I'm supposed to, I'm supposed to, I'm supposed to go. I don't know. Bro, that's, that's a that that's 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 a crazy ass um, Yo, situation. What the fuck I'm supposed to do, bro? I'm, if I if I snitch if I snitch on my man's, who's to say he's not gonna come back and try to kill me because I'm snitching? <laughs> fuck I'm supposed to do. So I'm, either I'm fucked, bro. Either way, bro. What the fuck I'm supposed to do? In that I'm gonna situation? keep it a buck. I'm not gonna lie. That nigga should like just get back for them. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, just get back for if you gonna, bro. I'm not gonna lie, son. Like you're already in danger. But I guess he, he just don't want to, cause like why N W Melly's his man's too. So I guess he don't want to actually See, kill he him. He don't want to, you know. Nigga, I think he he rather die than go to jail, <laughs> my nigga. For me, that nigga is going from nigga. He's he having a uh, he a famous rapper. That nigga about to go in jail. He was trying to get his nigga a death penalty. He didn't have that much. I don't think he gave him a death penalty. I don't think he gave him death penalty. I think that was on the table though. Oh, where? I think it was on the table at one point. Where? The death penalty. Damn. These niggas, I feel like the death penalty. They be bluffing with niggas. I don't really think niggas get that, bro. Nah, like, take is on death row, bro. He said on death penalty? I thought he got 54 years. Nah, that nigga is on death row. I thought I, they gave him 54 years. 54 shit. years? Damn. Yeah, they gave him 54 years. I don't think he on death penalty. They was trying, they put that on the table at first, but uh -huh. it got to 54 years ago. Uh, the niggas be bluffing when they give him that. I think that, that they be trying to scare him. I think Boozy was the one that was on it. Boozy was on a death penalty, but he beat the murder, though. I mean, yeah. Who to say if he would have lost, he would have got death penalty, but I don't know. But yeah, bro, it's a tricky situation. I don't know. So I think. <laughs> Me personally, bro, like that's what I'm saying, like you don't want to get that's to be staying away from situations. Cause I, like at the situation, at the same point, like they both ain't do nothing to me, so I don't want to go. That's what I'm saying, son. Kill this nigga. Yeah. I don't know, yo, cause you'd be mad cause he killed your man's, but it's like, damn. That's your man's too, though. Those are my man's. He who's just closer? killed two of my man's. <laughs> you gotta go who's closer. And then one of my man's killed two of my man's. It's that's like, like two. It's only you and him. I now. can't. Nah, I'm not gonna even. I'm not gonna jack say who's I'm, closer, bro. That's some bitch shit, bro. That's clear. That's some bitch. That's some bitch. That's some bitch. That's, some bitch nah, shit, bro. that's what I'm saying. That's the only thing. The only type of like reason you can. And use. I feel like I can't just yeah. sit back and not do anything either, bro. Cause nigga, you could do that to me. I mean, you could. You could do that to me. Just stay away from him. What's up with him, nigga? What's up with him? Just doing stay that to far you? away from him, nigga. Just you gotta move fucking militant, bro. You gotta make sure this nigga not around you. Don't don't call that nigga here, nigga. All I'm saying is that I, shit like juice, bro. This shit is just like juice, bro. All I'm saying, bro, I can't it's really, just, I can't really blame the nigga, bro. Wait, who? Um, I can't really blame the nigga for for going on stand, bro. I'm not saying I would personally uh, do that, but it's like it's a conflict. It's a, I feel like it's a lose lose, bro. Cause niggas are saying free double. Why? And first of all, y'all niggas listen to this afraid, nigga for three that, months. That nigga sound like a dickhead yep. on the songs. Y'all niggas bro. listen to him for three months. Three months. That this nigga was three out. Months, three he was a rapper for four months, and niggas said <laughs> three months. Three months. It's dead what the three fuck? Months. Nah, he dead ass came out. He only came out like two songs. Nah, where? Right? Bro. I think like the murder on my mom shit. That song that nice. mad overrated, bro. You like that song? <laughs> nah, nah. I just, I just think it's hyped up because like. Niggas is talking about all of this trial shit and making nah, it, blew, it, was, it, was, it blew up before though. Nah, nah. But it, it got a lot of streams afterwards too. Yeah. 
Because yeah, yeah. of um, this trial and shit. Yeah, it got a lot of streaming. I, I think, think it's just more the like the lore around it. Niggas is just, yeah, this nigga. Niggas like seeing this shit. Like, this nigga oh my god, he on trial. He rapping murder on my mind and shit. Niggas yeah. like that shit. But so. he can't. Wait, did he get convicted? If he beat it though, he might blow up though. I'm never gonna lie. Nah, hell yeah. That nigga gonna be. He's gonna be like Boozy, bro. When Boozy fucking beat the murder, that nigga was fucking. He came out. He was large, He was bigger than he, when he was before. Pause. Feel me? Nigga, when he beat the murder and shit, man, he was, for me, that's how it was gonna be. So if something beat the murder, bro, that nigga probably gonna be a number one star, bro. Facts. Oh, wow. He's doing what these niggas, that's how Vaughn would have been. If Vaughn would have, see, if Vaughn was alive and shit, bro, and someone would have got convicted of that murder of killing that, that bitch and shit, that girl, my fault calling it bitch, that girl and shit, <laughs> he got convicted of killing that girl, mm -hmm. and something, like, for some reason, that something beat it, and he came out, that nigga would have been 10 times what he was. I don't really like how niggas just be beating murders, bro. I'd be kind of like, <laughs> I be kind of iffy, bro. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. It be stacked against them nah, and niggas yeah, be yeah. beating them, bro. Niggas be, niggas be, niggas be, niggas be, yeah, he probably did it, you feel me? Most of the time, if you get, I don't know, bro. Cause no, not like did it. I be feeling like iffy, like, bro, how do you just beat this murder? That? I'll just stop you. Think he, you, think, you, think, you think he fucking, like, I be feeling like niggas be cooperating on? sometimes. I mean, if we don't see Like it, Snoop Dogg, niggas are saying that oh, that nigga man. was cooperating back in the day. I think he probably was, bro. And niggas, but like, the thing I don't like, though, bro, nah, you right. It's weird for me, cause I don't like niggas like, cause it's some nigga, you know that white nigga that be on YouTube and shit? That, uh, the, the, the Not war? No. <laughs> the fuck? I'm confused. <laughs> the nigga that be knowing mad shit about people? No, the nigga, that nigga that be put up, the same nigga snitching and shit, 1090 10, Jake. Oh, yeah, that nigga. That nigga. He See? signed the affidavit, the affidavit for, um, that, that nigga. Fuck. Cool. Yeah, I don't even know this nigga name, no. bro. For next time. Oh, for the, see, see, he he cruised mm -hmm. uh, son of snitching too, though. He he put out affidavit some shit. Hey man, right, work on it. But yeah, see, but like at the same time, like I don't like the 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 shit like where he put out niggas. But I understand, I understand, I do because that nigga probably put a nigga in jail though. Mm -hmm. Even though, and he's a part of the same life. <clears throat> see, bro, like me with bro, like I'm not a family. We didn't, I, for me, I didn't partake in no street activities and shit, but. I still believe in the thing. If you with somebody, y'all niggas both do the crime, nigga. Nigga, you snitch, bro. That's some bitch. You're not a man. You're you're a hoe. You're a bitch, bro, for doing that. Mm -hmm. And this is not open up because niggas love to do this, bro. They feel like civilians can't speak on snitching. Yo, bro, this, I feel like this is it common. It don't matter if you're Yeah, it's you common still sense, son. For being son, a son this is common bro. sense, bro. Like, if you in a situation your mans, bro, and y'all niggas both do a crime, and you come and tell your mans, you're, bro, that's that's not, bro. Let's yeah. not, so let's say this snitching word out the thing. You're, that's dishonorable, bro. Not you know like, I mean? not word. Even if there's okay. like no jail time involved, bro. Just that's you telling on them is just crazy. That's dishonorable, bro. So, I, so I understand that. So, so when niggas be saying, yo, the, the nigga thought you had his back and shit. Too, nah, it's a fact, though. So when niggas be like saying like, oh, yo, y'all niggas are villains. Y'all niggas still be speaking on that, bro. It's common sense, bro. That's how I know you just doing it just because you're not doing it for like the morality and shit. Uh -huh. Over, you're doing it just because it's like what it is. Like that's rule. It's that's crazy, crazy. Like niggas like. 1090 Jake, they make a living off of. Oh, yeah, he said he made millions. Bro, he make, they make living yeah. off of examining these yeah. hood rappers' lives and yeah. saying, yo, is this nigga really real right and shit? So he be paying, he gotta pay to get the paperwork and shit, cause that should be, sometimes that should be sealed. And sometimes, like I heard, he said some shit one time, he said, like, if you were in a state, right, say if you were like in Texas and shit, mm. and you and you from Florida, you can't request a nigga. Um, you can't request a nigga from from Texas paperwork if you live in Florida. Mm -hmm. So this nigga be going the extra mile to that shit. That nigga probably hitting up other niggas and connections and shit to get the paperwork and shit. So that nigga doing extra shit to get that shit, bro. Yeah, cause it's out of jurisdiction, I guess. Yeah, bro. And that nigga went to was in jail. That nigga it was a, was an ex criminal. He was an ex con. Shit, bro, nigga, these niggas, bro. I feel like Are these niggas make a lot. Of I don't know. Are you bro. working with the police? This is like TMZ on steroids. These niggas make money off of every angle in Son, a celebrity life. I'm not gonna lie, bro. I think somebody in New York about to get exposed, bro. Where? Somebody in New York about to get exposed. Like you know? I think, bro. I'm not gonna lie, bro. Fun son, like I don't. Nobody picked up on it, bro. But like I was watching some. I was watching this nigga tonight, Jake. He said some <coughs> shit. He said a rapper from New York. He had some shit from a rapper from New York, and he, he said the reason why he didn't put it out sooner because he thought this rapper was gonna die. Who's it? Who what? niggas is? Shit, nah, I don't fucking know. Think about it. Think it, bro. Think, bro. Nigga shy? A rapper from, no, a rapper from New York. That was gonna die? He was gonna die. That's why he's not gonna put it out. He didn't put it out sooner. Think about it, bro. He thought he was gonna die. 50? Think, bro. Think about it, bro. 50? No. Think about it. Think about TJ? it. TJ? Yes, bro. I think he's talking about TJ, bro. <laughs> I think he's talking about TJ, son. Because, bro, he said, he said, <laughs> it's a rapper from New York. 
The reason why he didn't oh, put out yeah, the shit because someone was some... about to die. He got yeah, shot nine recent. times. That's recent. That's oh nah what? I think it's nah, probably what? PJ. That's, oh, he got it. that's crazy. And I don't think niggas picked up on that. I picked up on that, bro. Word, that is crazy. Niggas said that. Niggas said so. I put this. I said, who the fuck is this nigga? Who was about to die in New York? <laughs> that 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 we was like, oh no, nah, this nigga probably. Bro, he's talking about TJ probably, bro. Oh damn. I'm not saying it's TJ, but he's probably talking about TJ. Who else from the rapper about to was I was about to die? Yeah, you right, you right. Damn. Bro, son. TJ been on the, like the radar too. He hasn't been yeah. really dropping. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, TJ. TJ, TJ, if you if they come out and say you a snitch, it's, it's clip for you, bro. It's clip. Damn. Damn. It's clip for you, bro. Damn. It's clip, son. Cause bro, you you rap about that too, though. And he was. Were they talking about like when he first came home and shit, and he started rapping? Or something else. It probably it, it probably was that when he first came home. It probably from that probably, mm-hmm. or probably I don't know if it's a shooting situation. Cause if niggas call him a snitch, cause that how's he gonna? I mean, mm-hmm. He probably did though. Damn. That's crazy. Are you gonna? But either way, snitches though, bro. Niggas moving like fucking FBI investigators. Bro. <laughs> but son, I put two hundred. He said it. I mean, son, I, he said he said a nigga nigga was about to die, as a New York rapper. Bro. I kind of. I kind of like, um, like hate niggas that be like dick riding, like. But I feel like sometimes you dead ass need to know, cause I don't want to be listening to a nigga. Yo, bro, you can't. That's like nah, making yeah. a facade, Facts. bro. I don't want. Bro, I'm not gonna lie, bro. If you if you tell, bro, you doing all the crime, bro. Even though, but you're still you're still dead. See, that's another thing too, though. If somebody snitched, though, but he still killed nigga, that nigga still dangerous person, bro. <laughs> it's not like we're not saying that nigga's pussy, bro. No, no you're still dangerous. He just don't want to go to jail, but he's still nah, dangerous, bro. That's actually worse. We're not saying that. That's actually worse. Yeah. Nigga, wanted, he did the comment, nigga don't so, want to yeah, go to jail. Yeah, we're not saying that. That's nigga. worse. We're not saying that. We're just saying that your character, you have character flow, bro. Yeah, yeah, you, you, your, your character, you have bad character, bro. You're dishonorable, bro. So I'm saying, yo, Lil TJ, bro, I hope you picked up on that, bro. Like, he probably didn't pick up on that, bro. Nah, that's good. Because he said, because this nigga, this nigga 1090 Jake said on, on No Jumper, nigga's not really watching No Jumper like that anymore, bro. Unless you really a fan like that. I told you nigga's not watching yeah, that. Niggas that's not what watching, I was saying, bro. Yeah, I, nigga's not really. I don't know. This Jason Love shit came out of nowhere. I don't know. But, that's all bro, I'm going to say, though. But the reason why I'm not saying that, bro, because, son, like, bro, Adam is still making money. He making money off the porn, bro. The nigga said he be pumping millions a year off of that. Yo. And nigga... And no jump, millions a year, bro. No jumper is probably not getting as much traction, but he said that they be monthly views, they be getting like 30 million views views a month, and that equates to money, bro. Niggas make millions a year and still um file for bankruptcy. I don't you think it's making money. millions and you spending millions, nigga. What do you make it? So I think he was, I think, <laughs> bro, I think he was right the first time when you said niggas is just sex addicts, bro. Where? I think he was right the first time when you said niggas is just sex addicts. He just rather profit off of that shit. Yeah, bro. I don't think I think niggas is just sex addicts and son. He felt like bro was fucking all these girls, so he had to do it, bro. And she's admitted that she used to be jealous too. Yeah, he admitted he used to be jealous. These niggas is not okay with it. That's what I'm saying. No, bro. her. She admitted she used to be jealous. Yeah. And she before she said nah, she wasn't jealous, but she she recanted. She's like nah, I used to be jealous. You were jealous you... at first. Yeah, yeah. Bro, every, anybody's gonna be jealous, man or woman. You, 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 Yo, they making this seem like so natural. This is why bro, I don't like. Not, I hate that. Bro. I don't like the monetization bro. of porn too much, bro. Cause oh. niggas make this shit seem so natural, bro. Nah, that's not natural, bro. We fucked up, yo. I'm not gonna lie, we fucked up too. If we watch porn, we fucked up too. Bro, bro even Twitter and back in the day, it was not too much, but it now it, it's, it's mad OnlyFans, bro. It's overly sexualized. Back then, you yeah. just want to go to the website. Now yeah. it's all over the place, bro. Son, nigga, niggas, not nah, everywhere, bro. Like if you click on it, you could probably find, find a fire bid on the book, bro. This it used to be girls. Last option when they try to make money and pay bills, they couldn't do nothing. Nah, now it's girls. First now it's their first option, bro. That's sad. It's oversaturated, bro. Yeah, bro. Like, yeah, son. Like, like you was right the first time when you said, bro, the niggas is doing, they gluttons, bro. Nah, Feel right. me? You on the Bible that says, don't be a glutton, they gluttons, bro. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They they overly sexual. So you said, I mean, yeah, it was it was new. It was new. Oh, man. <laughs> and she, you, you know what's getting me, you know what's getting me tight? You know what gets me bro. tight, bro? That would you, know, you know, You know you mad at, at, at a girl? <laughs> And she used like words that are mad, like ambiguous and shit, just to like downplay it. But yeah. like it's bro, like say what you is, bro. If you if you if it felt mad good, say that shit, bro. Don't downplay it. Don't play with my fucking Now she said it hurt when, when she tried to have sex with Adam. Oh. It hurt. It hurt. <laughs> yeah, this nigga said it hurt. She, she said it hurt, bro. She was like, bro, she was going into detail. Nah, you a whore. Shit. Nah, you a whore, bro. Nah, I'm not gonna lie, you're a whore, bro. I'm, like and like and we're not like you're a whore, bro. It's not like I'm I'm being over exaggerated. You're a whore, bro. Son. Another person that do this is uh, uh, he fell off, bro, from the West Coast. Who my son? Blueface. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah. How he resorted to the OnlyFans and shit. 
Yeah, to make yeah. his bread. That nigga was making a lot of money off of it. Like 40, I think he said he was oh, making yeah, 40 so, a week yeah, or something. Yeah, he was making 40 a week, bro. Only fans was booming at one point. When it first came out, for me, niggas was saying they making a mellow, bitches was saying they making a mellow month. I'm like, what? <laughs> bitch, you don't look that good, bro. You think these niggas is that down bad or these nah, bitches it's is a, tapping? It's a subscription and then you yeah. got, and then when you got the subscription, you could pay to get private videos and shit. And extra, it's extra yo, payments type shit. Yo, are y'all niggas that down bad? It be these niggas. It's like a game, like a DLC. Yo, it be these niggas that be having these engineer degrees, bro. They be they be mad tired from work, bro. These niggas just want to. And they have a girl. Yo, a lot of y'all boyfriends are on these holy fans. That's all I'm going to say, man. That shit bad. That's all I'm going to say, bro. Yo, yo, any, bro, I'm not going to lie. Any one of my mans, I found they buying only fans, Yo, bro. niggas buying only fans, bro. That's bad, Actually, bro. ask your friends, bro. That's bad. You, be, nah, I'm you probably be nah, surprised. I'm at least one of them niggas. <laughs> you got some mans that buy only fans? Yes, bro. Oh, my God. Yes, bro. Or they go on Reddit. Niggas, all right. Yo, yo that yo, niggas go on Reddit for Or they go on Reddit, bro. <laughs> yo, is that that bad now? Yo, <laughs> Why, bro? Pornhub is right there. No videos on Pornhub is on Reddit. Am I bugging? Yo, nah, son. nah, it don't be, bro. Even some differences? Nah, though, because the Reddit is leaked. Oh my god, oh, you know this shit got leaked. Bro, this shit on Reddit? Why these niggas going on Reddit, bro? Yeah, niggas is diving deep for this shit, bro. Facts. No, but nah, um, yeah, speaking of down blue bad, face, bro. Yeah, it's a lot. Of, it's not that much controversy. Niggas is not really <laughs> talking about it as much as they need to, because this nigga, I realize this nigga is kind of like a fucked up person all around. Like this nigga had like um two oh, two he's for two burnt bitches um not ugly ass bitches shaking ass in front of his daughter mm. in a couch and uh, the bitch he talking to was there talking about oh, this is a regular Tuesday he woke up to his son and be like yo they're shaking their ass in here what are you doing I'm looking for candy nigga he's like yo I'm looking for candy he was like are, is you gay <laughs> you better not be gay. Bro, he's five years old, bro. Five years old, bro. Oh my god. Like, yeah. bro, what the fuck? So, like, I don't want to say, I don't want to say, son's a fucked up person because I don't know the nigga, bro. But you're doing too much for club, bro. bro. And he has a camera in front of his yeah, son's doing, face too. Yeah, you're doing too much, blue face, bro. I understand, bro. You gotta meet that monthly quarter to like to 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 to, to fund yourself all the expenses if you do and shit, the weed and all that, the, the crib and shit, <clears throat> bro. But like, yeah, that's too much, bro. I bro, know what he is. and you know how like. You know when your like, your parent like beat you and you and then they tell you sit down and you just sitting down like mad traumatized. Yeah. That's that. That's how his daughter was looking like, bro. She was not moving a muscle when she was watching them shit. <laughs> yeah, bro. That's child abuse, bro. Yeah, you can't do that, bro. <laughs> but it's like, yo, who else is gonna take that? And the bro? son, is, son, like the son, and I don't think bro is ten yet. I think the He's son is five, five, five. Oh, his six, son is five. Five or six, bro. Yeah, bro. He don't, bro. He's not gonna know what it is, bro. That could be trauma. I mean, I don't know, bro. I mean, it should. It should go both ways. Just how niggas be saying like they don't want niggas doing that 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 homosexual stuff around their kids. It's the same shit applies to fucking heterosexual niggas, mm -hmm. bro. Same shit applies, bro. You can't really expose these kids to fucking that shit at a young age. You feel me? And, and niggas like them hypersexual and shit. Yeah, even and even like you know niggas be saying. I mean, even though nigga, I be joking when I be saying that. I be like, oh, I wish when I was a kid, I was seeing as it. But nah, realistically, I wasn't. Obviously, I wasn't. You feel me? I, I wasn't really. Well. That's not good. Not that age. Yeah. Not that age. Not yeah, that well, age. Well, bro, you said it. Not at five, bro. Bro, you was jacking at nine years old. You was watching porn. Yeah, that's crazy. Bro, that's what, wacky, how bro. old are you in the fifth that's wacky, grade? Bro. That's wacky, bro. How old are you bro. in fifth grade, bro? You said nine. Don't change what you how said. How old are you in the fifth grade, You said nine years bro. old, bro. You said nine years I, old. I estimated that I would be nigga, nine. Nigga, you said right, nine, bro. That means it's eight then. Cause niggas be me. Bro, I was 11, bro. I was 11. Now you saying 11. Look at this nigga. Niggas say 11. Niggas say 11. I was 14 going into high school. Now you saying you was fourteen? That's, I was four, no going into high school, so in the fifth grade, that would be like three years back or four till it's like 11, ten, eleven, bro. So nigga, you sat you sat nine years old before. Nah, bro. I was now I you was, saying I was, I was nigga I was, I was dramatic, bro. bro. I was dramatic. Nah, you was wilding, bro. You was at nine years old. Yeah, bugging. nigga, I, I hit puberty early. Yeah, you were bugging. Yeah, yeah, saying, yeah, yeah, bro. I, I mean, heard proof respect, early, respect bro. bro. That's crazy, though. I mean, I heard nigga at nine years old, and everybody's watching fucking Bakugan. This nigga watching Pornhub. I mean, I don't nigga, know. I was doing both. You got to be versatile, <laughs> bro. I'm not going to lie, bro. It's the HBO. It's like... So I was 12. It was forbidden. So it was I was 12. Bro. I was 12. That's when I started. It was I mean, forbidden, was like bro. It's like old, huh? whenever my mom see a show and they doing something, she cover my eyes. It was forbidden. So I wanted to see that shit more, bro. But you was wild. You saying you was doing the whole thing when you was dying, bro. Relax, bro. Nah, son, nice. nigga, go outside, bro. Go hoop, bro. I was outside, bro. That's nigga, when I come home, bro. I'm happy. <laughs> nigga, <laughs> nigga, stressed at nine years old. 
<laughs> bro, I was not stressed, bro. I was stressed. Bro, why are you getting off on you? Nah, that's not crazy, bro. Yeah, you it's crazy. Off on you nine, I'm not going to say that shit. It's, it's 10. Yeah, I was bro, 10 or 11, you was nine. bro. Stop saying you was 9. Just say what you was. You was 9 years old, I was old, 10 bro. or 11, bro. You was bro. 9, bro. For me. I'm not saying that it was normal, but I'm going to say that, yeah, that shit was fucked up, bro. I'm you felt relieved bro. after you did it, bro. I felt like I was doing something I was supposed to do, and that's why I like doing it so much. Shut up. Yeah, nigga, you know you was doing, nigga. You saw that shit, nigga. It was like, nah, yeah. I knew what I was doing, but if I felt like it was, I was not supposed to be doing it, and that's why I wanted to do it. This nigga, crazy. Nigga. Every time a sex scene come on, bro, I can't see that shit. When I look up and I got a laptop, nigga, when I got my first laptop, so, bro, bro, you, bro. You had a, bro, whoa. I was on the laptop, nigga. You was on a laptop doing that shit? That's fucked up, bro. That's crazy. That means you don't even care about nobody in the crib. Bro. You just, you <laughs> it see, was my laptop. Nah, bro. it was my laptop. That's crazy, though, bro. It was my laptop. But your bro. mom probably was touching the laptop, bro. My mom never even know how to use a laptop. I'm gonna keep it a book. <laughs> <laughs> how the fuck you got a laptop then? Bro, she just bought it for me, bro. Sound like you got night. Yeah, that's crazy, bro. Yo, bro, I'm gonna keep it a book, bro. That was fucked up. That shit made me like really hypersexual at a young age, bro. I wanted to see what the fuck was going on. But I feel like it, I feel like it peaked when I was in middle school. I wasn't really worried about that shit. I, st I feel like when I started doing it, I was like, yeah, this shit not really that hyped out to let us be. So then you want to have sex? Then you want to say that, bro? Until in high school. That that happened to high school. Yeah, that right, happened to high school. Nigga was, was being off at nine. That's Yo, crazy. bro, that's why you can't be exposed to kids to shit like this. What the fuck? <laughs> This is the moral of the story. Don't be exposed to kids and shit like this, bro. <laughs> Yo, nah, nah, that's a fact, though, because I feel like, then, especially at a young age, niggas exposing that shit. Too young, you feel me? But I feel like at the time, you're supposed to see that shit, though, because Exposure know. and withholding? Can, withholding, yeah, That yeah, shit facts, could facts, fuck facts, you facts, up, because you're going to want to... Either way, you're going to probably want to do that shit, just because of that. I'm not going to lie, but don't... Hey, see? Look at look this nigga doing. Nigga, you're nine, bro. Your mom not withholding it, bro. She just, I mean, she's letting you come gracefully, bro. Nigga, you're nine years old. Nigga said, <laughs> nigga, I got his mom was withholding. <laughs> not withholding it, bro, but like, bro, you know, you used to do shit you know you was not supposed to do, bro. At nine, nigga? I wasn't. At nine years old, nigga? I wasn't, bro. You saying you was being off at nine, bro. That's crazy. At nine years old, nigga, me and my friends was bringing bitches in his crib at, at right. in the middle school, what bro. What y'all doing, at 10. Though? What y'all doing? Kissing in the bathroom, nigga. Ah, y'all wasn't. It's kissing, bro. It's and different. trying to go and trying to go the next mile, nigga. Niggas yeah. was trying to get there, bro. So niggas can't yeah, even not, yeah, say that, yeah, bro. Yeah, I'm, I'm not, not the that. only one, bro. So I got some man. When niggas was doing. in middle school, yeah. niggas was trying to get buns. Nah, niggas was getting buns in middle school, bro. The most I got was top. In middle I'm school? Keep it a buck. Nah, I ain't get top. I'ma keep it a buck. I didn't ever went all the way. Figured, but I ain't get top. Bro. I That's never, crazy, I never went all the way. Cause nah, cause bro, I'm not gonna lie. I'ma keep it a buck. Yo, we had this one show you that she, yo, oh, bro, man. she was the that ass just giving this shit out like. No I'm not gonna lie, shit. bro. But yeah. now that I look at back yo, at it, that shit fucked up. I'm not gonna lie, yo. I'm just gonna say one word. If you know, you know, bro. I'm just gonna say that, bro. Like I might, cause I don't want to for me. Like yeah, you, I, I, I agree with that, bro. That shit was happening. Bro. It was <laughs> always that one for me. That one special. That, that I would special. never go that way though, cause I never went that long though. Like third base, fourth base, cause I was scared. I was scared, nigga. I, I'm gonna keep it a book. I was too yeah, scared I, to do that. Yeah, shit. Dumb, I wanted some stupid shit. <laughs> <laughs> nah, word, bro. That shit for me. That shit. But I'm not gonna lie, son. Nothing that's reason. <laughs> Why, bro? Like when you, when your kids when you when you got when I have my kids, I'm gonna make sure that they're involved in shit at a young age. Like they're involved in like sports and shit. Like they always got some shit to do. Cause bro, that should be most. Yeah, that's the worst. The worst niggas was the niggas on the sports team, bro. Nah, bro. Come the on. The niggas on bro, the sports saying, team was doing not the worst high school, than not high school. Bro. Son, I'm talking about like when we like when we kids, like we like five, six, seven, eight, nine, mm -hmm. ten. Then you play you play in the little league shit in your neighborhood and shit. I'm talking about that. Like, I'm not talking about, like, high school. High school is different. The girls, the high school. boys on the middle school basketball team, bro, was still... <laughs> all right, that's all I'm going to say. Bro. That's cool. That's cool, though. We talk... <laughs> all right, all right, bro. You dragging it. Oh, I'm, yo, man. bro. Dead oh, ass, bro. Man. Dead ass. But I'm saying, that? though, just to mitigate it, I'm not saying, like, you're going to expect it. The only way it. to mitigate it is to tell them. I feel like you should tell them, but also keep them involved in activities so they won't have... Like, I feel like that's... Most of that shit, bro, niggas didn't really want it. We just did it because we was bored most of the time. Mm. Most of the shit we did was because we was bored at a young age, feel me? Mm. Like, I wasn't really bored at a young age. I was always involved. In I was playing sports and shit. Niggas had this and shit. So I wasn't, even though I was still doing stupid shit, though. Yeah, but you're right, bro. I feel like it's... Yeah, yeah bro, you your, par balance. your parents you tell you, yo, if, you get, yeah. if somebody hits you, hit them back. If you're angry, don't fight back sometimes. But when you feel that way, nigga... You don't know what the but fuck I'm, to do. But I'm not gonna lie, my, when you feel that hot feeling in you, nigga, you don't know what the fuck to do. But I'm not gonna lie, my parents didn't. But my parents didn't fucking tell me about sex, bro. Mm -hmm. Bro, my parents. Nah, never, nah, never, nah. never. Well, 
Like, never. By the old age, though, nigga. I was like 18, bro. Nigga was beating hey. bro. I was beating on before that. <laughs> Real shit, bro. Like, my parents never, especially my, my mom never told me some shit about that, bro. Oh, right. My mom, but my dad, he was saying this jokingly. He never really sat down and had a serious car. Until, like, I was like, like 18 or some shit. He'd be like, yo, be careful. Don't be doing stupid shit, man. Make sure, you feel me? But like he, like like sixteen when you post like sit the age fifteen to sixteen like my dad didn't tell me nothing about that. Bro. Nigga, my brother's parting gift to me when he went to college and I went condoms, to high school is fucking condoms. Nah, that's your brother though. I'm talking about your parents. <laughs> nah, my mom, my parents and my my mom they talked to me a little bit, but when they actually found out that I lost my virginity, they they really sat me down. Uh, <laughs> nigga, my parents still think I'm a bird. Fuck out of here. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> nah, for my mom though. I mean, that tell the story on the pod, bro. That <laughs> tell the story on the pod when niggas stopped for me. That's some moms be dragging everything, bro. That nigga, nigga thought I beat some girl my mom. Yo, bro, son. I'm not gonna get too crazy in the story, bro, cause son, like, for me, I don't wanna put niggas' business out there and shit, but son, bro, nigga, I got accused. Nigga was trying to say I beat a girl in my, my mom's bed, bro. Basically. <laughs> nah, they that's saying, they say, I, that's, they say, that's what they saying. Cause, yo, bro, this is what happened, bro. Son, my dumb ass, bro, for me, I had a show in the cab, for me, I had a show in the mom's mm-hmm. spot and shit, for me. Nigga, my dumb ass, you being dumb, bro. Sometimes we just do dumb. You know, you do some some dumb some dumb shit. You be like, why the fuck did I do that? I didn't have to do that at all. Yeah, bro, it was a testosterone take. But listen though, I was being responsible and shit, bro. Mm-hmm. Feel me? I did not beat this girl in my mom's room. First of all, I did not. We did not. I didn't. I didn't beat her in my mom's room, bro. Mm-hmm. I didn't, bro. Mm-hmm. But what I did do? Living room, bathroom. Nah, living room, of course. <laughs> you know what I mean? What I did do, my dumb ass. I left the con. I, I left the. I put the condoms in my mom's um Nigga, trash in her room, bro. What type of dumb shit? Is that was that? so. Nah, it's dumb, bro. Nah, real shit, bro. It's the dumbest shit. Nigga, that's, something, that's probably the most dumbest shit I ever did in my whole life, bro. bro that's something like, bro. You know when you tell him that's the truth. That's God, bro. That's God. God did that. God wanted me to get caught, bro. <laughs> you know somebody. You, you know. I wasn't you know even if you're telling bro. the truth, but like the odds are stacked bro, against you, son, so you can't. Yo, this even, hot, bro. So you got no choice son, but to just take son, it. Son, this is how I felt, bro. I'm like, yo, I was, t- I was telling, yo, bro, I did not, <coughs> I did not, I did not fucking. First of all, I was lying. I said, yo, I didn't bring no girl in the house. <laughs> I was saying I didn't bring, cause, bro, that's how I was raised, bro. I be lying, bro. <laughs> I be lying, especially with some shit like this, bro. Niggas acting like I'm a fucking demon, like I'm, I'm possessed, bro. Yeah, bro. If you always lying, bro, when you tell the truth, <laughs> one time you told the yeah. truth, they're not gonna believe you, Yo, bro. bro I, I had a, bro, it was so serious. I had to call my, I had to call my bro, my big bro. Mm-hmm. And tell my, tell my parents to like, yo, bro, he's telling the truth and shit, bro. But they still think I'm most capping about that. But bro, yeah, bro, I got accused for doing some shit like that. But you know why? That's why though. Cause my parents don't really feel me. We, we wasn't talking about shit like that, bro. Mm-hmm. So they'll probably think I'll do some stupid shit like that, bro. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Nah. Nigga, kill me for that, bro. That shit crazy, son. That shit crazy, son. That's nah, probably the dumbest. That's that probably the dumbest shit I ever did in my life, bro. I wouldn't do that to my parents ever. What? What? what I wouldn't be in my parents' room. Yo, bro. So, like, I didn't do. First, I was not in my parents' room, bro. Like, I didn't do that, bro. I agree with you, bro. I'll never do something like that. I'll never do that, bro. To me, I, I don't even let bitches know I actually live, bro. So, nigga, I, of course I won't do it in my fucking mom's room, bro. The fuck up is wrong these? Yo, that's just crazy. But like off that, what were you talking about? But like off that, bro. Jonah Hill shit. But yeah, but the Jonah Hill. Yeah, go speaking on that too, though. Um, my son Jonah Hill has some woman issues, bro. That will tell you that it don't matter how from his fame you got. These bitches always act the same towards you. Yo, him, I think this situation is how Kiki boyfriend should have handled it. Mm. Like no funny shit. Oh, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. He handled it properly. He yeah, yeah. texted her type shit. It was like, yeah, I, these are my boundaries. You doing all of this is not going to work type yeah. shit. See, Jonah real nigga, man. Shout out Jonah, man. Hope y'all niggas take notes what Jonah did, bro. But what I don't like, bro, is that, yo, I feel like these girls, for me, they don't understand that, bro. Mm-hmm. Like, if you tell them some, if you tell them some shit like they did, and then you, then you, then you bring it up again, and, and they be like, yo, why you, why you, why you acting like that? No, I told you this is what I, I don't stand for. And you, you went against it. So that means my trust is gone, bro. So we out of here. Sometimes they feel like they don't have to, bro. If a bitch wants to, she gonna want to, bro. Sometimes they feel like they, their trust is too high. Like, they don't need to, like, conform for nobody type shit. Nah. Until they hit 30 and then now they conform with everything. It's like, oh, yeah, you niggas be right. But that's all I'm gonna say. That's all I'm gonna say. <laughs> but that's, uh, that's, yeah. just, that's just what it is, bro. They feel like we can't do nothing and they could do everything type shit. Yeah, bro. And that's just... And, like, bro, don't let nobody tell you that you being insecure 
Now like you're not secure your own masculinity, wherever that bullshit is, bro. <clears throat> what are you talking about? You niggas not securing your own masculinity. Now, isn't, that, isn't that masculine to tell like uh, uh, what what you don't stand for and what you don't tolerate? Am I bugging? It is. So like Nah, they use they weaponize it, bro. They weaponize it. They, yeah. they call you insecure so you can feel humiliated and like and, like, and cooperate, be like, okay, yeah. I'm 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 maybe I'm being they're trying to gaslight you, bro. You know what's crazy? That's bro? a form of manipulation. You know what's bro? the problem nowadays, bro? You know what the problem is, bro? Niggas is seeking validation from from bitches instead of their own mans, bro. What? Listen, bro. That's how crazy. Hey, yo. But listen, oh. listen. No, listen, niggas. Niggas, see this nigga lying in the gutter, bro. That's why niggas can't see. That's why these this podcast will never be serious, bro. Niggas, bro. Niggas can't say anything. When niggas get serious, bro, niggas want to think about some other shit, bro. Niggas, come on, bro. Wait, what? That now? Nah, explain listen, that. Bro, explain that. I'm explain. explain it, I, I'm explain it. I'm explain it. Explain, explain it. Like explain I said, let me repeat what I said, bro. The problem is that I feel like niggas is seeking validation from these bitches instead of from these niggas, bro. Meaning. If you do something, bro, what should you be? You should be seeking, like, um, um, um. What's it? What's it? What's the word? What's the word? A third party. Uh, like, yeah, like, like a third party from your man's, cause you're Second a opinion. you're a nigga, yeah, cause you're a nigga. Feel me? If your man's be like, yo, bro, yeah, bro, you was right, bro, yeah, she shouldn't be wearing this stupid shit to the club and shit. Don't seek shit from a girl, bro. That's a girl, bro. She's not gonna fuck a girl. That's a girl. She's gonna obviously. I, I feel like a girl's supposed to stick up for girls, right? That's not true all the time, bro. Man, you know what I'm saying? That's not true all the time, bro. Yeah. I'm gonna keep it a bug, bro. Well, well I was. That's not true all the time, bro. You feel like, yeah, nah, you're right. Because right. there's some girls that's not like there's not every girl is like that, bro. You feel like yeah, some girls will take their niggas side though. That's a fact, though. I agree with that. Like, good girls, good girls. Like, um, but some, you can't tell all your mans because some of them people, not, niggas just be not, yes men. Not bro. all of them. Are, nah, you, your mans, like, your, your mans, niggas, your mans, the 10 years of whatever y'all niggas want to call it, but niggas you know, niggas you know, like, you got some shit with, you know that I keep it real, don't really give a fuck about you. Y'all niggas can, you feel me? But, like, if it's a yes man, nah, yeah. If my niggas, I, I think I got people like that who would tell me I'll fuck up. Niggas, yo, bro. I, I think, think you, I think, I'm not gonna lie. To, this is what I've been doing lately, bro. bro. Yeah. Well, when I'm in a relationship, I guess. I don't see if I don't seek advice from people that are not in successful that relationships. Not in relationships, yeah. Or not in relationships. Yeah, don't seek advice from nigga, people. Nigga, you already know. <laughs> nigga, <laughs> at the end of the day, I'm my friends you. are gonna want me to be single with yeah, them and outside out. doing stupid shit. Niggas gonna tell you to crash out. Niggas gonna tell me yes, bro. So I'm not gonna take it. If I really nah, want to be yes, successful in a relationship, true I'm true not gonna take no advice from them. I'm not gonna lie, and son, I did this in the past, bro. I'm not gonna lie. And I'll seek advice from 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 my mans that I know that's gonna be on my side, bro. Girls do the same shit, yeah, bro. Yeah, that's a fact, though. That's Girls have surrounded that's themselves it, with yes men, bro. None it. of their friends is gonna tell them. That's it. It's un that's unlikely. But when it's it unlikely. when it pertains to some shit, I'm wrong. It be it be hard, especially when it comes to like racism, when we don't really hold it to a high degree mm -hmm. compared to other shit in life. If it's some other shit in life that's like really gonna pertain to like life or death. Or, me, or, or success or some shit, your yeah, well being. I'll definitely seek somebody who I know is gonna tell I, me the real shit, but. Like, I'm gonna right, keep it up, bro. My like, but if it's bitches, bro, yo, nigga, if I'm gonna... fight, like, what if I'm, if I'm fighting temptation, bro, and I ask my man, yo, bro, I'm having problems, <laughs> I'm fighting temptation, I don't wanna cheat on my bitch, they're gonna tell me, don't no, fight that shit, That's bro. Bad, Courtney, they're bro. not gonna tell me not fight that. They tell <laughs> me. They're gonna, gonna, gonty... gonna seek out vice versa, man. <laughs> bro, that's real shit, bro. Niggas, people fight. Fighting temptation? People be in 30 years relationship. You can't tell me you've not been tempted at one point. To have to no, I'm saying that. I'm saying that. I'm saying that. I'm saying that, bro. I don't, bro. I don't mock a lot, bro. Even if your, your man's told you like, don't do it, you gonna do it, bro. It's that I don't. You never know, bro. Some somebody, somebody would say, don't do it, and somebody will not do that shit. Bro, bro. if a girl walk in your crib, bro, like it's a girl you always wanted. This is a girl that you find the temptation over. She walk in your crib, your girl nowhere around. She went to. Why she, the fuck she coming to my crib she, for? Nah, she just came. I don't know, nigga. She know where you live. She just knocked on your door and she came to your crib. Like, well, why are you here? You're not gonna tell her to go home. No, you're not. You're lying. So yeah. Let me let me, of, let me let me cut it off. First of all, let me cut off before you start talking. How does she know talking. where I live? That's me, a red flag. See, this nigga love doing That's this, a red bro. Flag, bro. Nigga, I just said one thing. I said I just told you why she knows where she lives. She know where you live, bro. Nigga, mm -hmm. if I, bro, once I give her the Addy, nigga, fighting temptation is done. Yeah. That's done. But she know. Not, there's no more fighting you temptation. Her, you didn't give her the Addy though. What? She, she just know where you live at, bro. That's whack. And she, and she looked mad good, bro. Yo, no bitch that I'm fighting temptation is knowing my Addy. Because if they know my Addy, hey, fighting temptation hey, is done. That's, nigga. What that's what I'm saying, bro. So, nigga, if a girl come to your crib, bro, nigga, if, find, nigga, if she comes to my crib, nigga, it's gonna go down. You don't gotta seek advice. Any, any girl I invite to my crib or in my crib that knows where I live, yeah. and they come, it's gonna go down, bro. So, you didn't seek. So, yeah, I'm saying you don't gotta seek advice from your niggas, bro. I'm saying before all of that, before all of that, before the, what if some coworker or some shit, 
Like, I got to talk to somebody about this shit, bro. That's a real-ass situation, bro. Niggas don't talk about that, Oh, bro. this is like, like... That's a real situation, bro. <laughs> you ever want to be with a bitch and you be like, yo, damn, oh, I can fuck man. this bitch. But I don't want to do it because I want to see where this go, nigga. That's oh, a real-ass situation, no, bro. you don't want to win, bro. We That's a real-ass situation. Do, but I'm going to say that yeah. I need somebody to, like, tell me, like, bro, don't do it. You feel me? Because I might, nigga, that one nudge be like, oh, do it. Or something that somebody don't tell me, knock some sense to me. That shit might put me over the border and I might do that shit. Yeah. <laughs> I might I'm not going to lie, shit. me personally, bro. And that's with, any, that's with anything, too. That's with anything. Me personally, yeah. So we talking about girls. First of all, hey, plus, like, this is not, we talking about girls. Girls are like, always going to be here. We, that's what I'm saying. I'll be more lenient with this, bro. Because it's not pertaining my whole life, bro. <laughs> this is just one thing. This girl probably, for me, this girl come and go and shit. So that's why I'm giving more leeway to it, bro, because it's not that. But if it's something like like finances or some other shit, like your career or some shit, I'm gonna be like, I'm gonna actually want to like real advice and shit. But with this shit, I want to hear what I want to hear, bro. Damn. That's fucked up, right? Yeah, I know, bro. It's messed up. We all working, we all working ourselves, bro. It's fucked up, bro. It's fucked up. That's how I tell you. That's tell people, bro. Yeah, if I want to hear what I hear, I'm gonna definitely ask my friends, bro. I'm exactly, bro. Especially when it plays the girls, bro. <laughs> nigga, nigga, bro, me personally, bro, if a nigga hit me talking about a girl, bro, why the fuck am I taking a girl's side, bro? What the fuck am I doing? I don't know the girl. That sound crazy, right? <laughs> nigga, everybody think the same way, bro. That's so what I'm saying. Nigga, so if nigga is like, yo, bro, I'm about to punch this nigga bitch. Nigga about to say this. I'm about to punch this bitch. Nah, nah, nah. You yeah, like, nah, nah, nah. Don't, don't punch, don't punch we talk, that bitch, we, we talking about temptation, like sexual desires, bro. <laughs> We're not talking about fucking abusing the girl. Nah, hell. <laughs> nigga, you said you going to take the girl. Nah, I'm not gonna do it. I'm like, nah, I'm gonna be, about to be bugged. Bro, what if you catch the clot, bro? What if niggas catch the clot? Don't clock? go in and shit with no condom, bro. Bro, I'm you not, can still catch the I'm not gonna. Bro, you can still not, catch the clot. Son, I'm not gonna give you mad bro. fucking advice, nigga, how to fucking bro, protect. You can still catch something with the clot. Bro, I hope, bro. I hope the bitch is clean, though, bro. Nigga, nigga I hope my man's is fucking with a clean bitch. Bro, you said that you don't want a nigga to go to jail, nigga. Uh, extreme situ- That's an extreme situation. Nigga extreme clap. situation, oh nigga. Oh my god. He catch a clot, he get a pregnant. What's the percentage you catching the clot, bro? Especially if my man, this is my man's girl. A lot of niggas cheat and get get something. I mean, that's all I'm gonna yeah, say. That's probably karma. Right? People be cheating and catching shit, bro, and giving it back to their girl. Yeah, I, nah. <laughs> and I heard that's a, that's a, and that's a really for me. That's a what's the word the, the niggas be saying? That's a real epidemic, bro. That's an epidemic in Brooklyn, bro. <laughs> Y'all niggas be cheating and giving the, your girlfriends the clap, bro. Nah, cheating and going wrong is crazy, crazy, bro. Nah, cheating that and going wrong is crazy. That means you don't give. Up. That means like you just like for me. You probably snitch on your mans, bro. I'm not gonna lie, bro. If you do that, well, you use, you not use the condom, you wanna fuck, bro. Come on, bro. Like, what are we doing here, bro? Like, I'll probably, bro, I'm probably, you're not my mans anymore, bro. Word, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Nah, bro. I'm not cheating, bro. That's crazy, That's bro. crazy, son. Even though it's tempting, though. Mm-hmm. Even though it makes it 10 times better. You know what I'm saying? But it's, it's, uh, <laughs> oh, man. Yeah. Damn, son. Nah, it shouldn't be happening, bro. Why you think niggas talk about this? This shit probably, for me, Shit, 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 not far fetched, bro. It's shit, shit, sad. Out but here. with the General Hill situation, yeah, yeah, I think he had it well, bro. Yeah, he had it well. He had nah. that shit better than me. I would have fucking, I would have fucking replied under her Instagram. So you a fucking bird? Oh man, get off my fucking phone with this dumb shit. No, nah, no funny shit. I would have, yeah, I would have embarrassed and her. That, that would have been a good reply too. Well. I would have embarrassed her. I don't her, see nothing wrong with that for me. If I, if, if I know a shorty fucking with me and she embarrassed me, I'm gonna embarrass I'm gonna call you back. A fucking bird, nigga. <laughs> Are you gonna, you gonna expose her on a gram and shit? I'm gonna call. Nah, not expose her. I'm gonna text her. I'm, I'm gonna text call her. her. I'm gonna call her. In front her friends, like you're a fucking bird. Yeah, don't call my line again. And I'm gonna throw the friend. Too. Fact, no just because. Shit. And I'm gonna throw the Frank, bro. I haven't thrown a Frank in a bitch in mad long, bro. Word. I haven't done that shit mad long. Problem getting me so, bro. When's the last time you threw a Frank at a bitch? Yo, I've never been mad enough to tell the bitch suck my nah, dick, I ne- bro. Yo, I've never told a bitch something. I've never been mad I said suck my dick and like we was playing though. It was like a nah. joke. I never said it like like I was mad, like tight, bro. Cause you remember back in high school when niggas when the bitches used to be doing, I'd be like, oh, I'm gonna get my brother to come to school then. <laughs> I used to believe that shit too at a point, bro. Until I saw these bitches was lying and shit. No, these these bitches' brothers was in sixth grade and shit. I'm like, yeah, fuck you, you're man. lying, bro. But <laughs> but that's all my main reason I didn't say that at that time. But like, nah, I never really. I don't do that shit no more. Niggas said no more. <laughs> it's more disrespectful shit to say. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> nah, what? Real shit. If you saw, if you saw a girl like you tell her about her life, you tell her, like, yo, you're you're very immature. This is like, some fatherless like, behavior. Like, we you're, got going you're, like on. you're doing bad shit. Like you're part of, you're doing father's behavior. Like like you'll never like be <laughs> successful in your life and shit acting this way. <laughs> yeah, bitches take that more. So you're right, bro. Bitches will take that more silly. Cause some of my dick is just like 
It's regular. They hear that every day. In New York, at least. Yeah, they hear that every day. Yeah. yeah. They hear that every day. So you say some shit that to the bitch, they would say that. What's the some, what's some shit you said to a bitch that got, that got them in their feelings crazy? That, like, they was like, yo, that's crazy. So, like, they, they got mad, like, sad over it. They was tight. Like, it hurt them. Like, you said, not not nothing vulgar, but you said something that, like, they, they took crazy, personally. And it was just, like, something that's not really derogatory, but it was, like, for me, it was, like, it, like hit them in their heart and shit. You know what I'm saying? I did nothing crazy. I told a bitch, yo, you fucking, you're annoying me right now. Like, oh, they, they I want to go home. They took that crazy? Yeah, she felt like, Oh, you said that in person? Yeah, in person. Woo! <laughs> yeah, I never said yeah. no crazy shit than that, but she felt the way. What I, yeah. I feel like I feel like any bitch will feel the way. Bro. I said, I, I'm I, not gonna lie. I told a girl you're dumb, but I was saying, but I was saying this in a, in a joking way though. I nah, I was dumb. not joking. I was like, yo, you're fucking annoying me right now. Oh man, <laughs> and she took that. Nigga, I was serious. I hope she took yeah. that serious, yeah, bro. Yeah, 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 Cause she act like a fucking little ass kid, bro. Oh man, public too though. Nah, crazy. Nah, she was acting like. Like a bad drunk, bro. Bad drunk, bro. Oh, bad drunk, bro. Bad drunk, bro. Man, bad man. drunk, bro. That sounds like drinking around. Like, yo, you can't. Yeah, bro, you can't. Yo, I saw. I, be, I was telling my brother this the other day. I'm like, bro, I'm not drinking around niggas I don't know. Like for me, like even still though, cause you don't know, bro. Especially a girl. I sound like girls like they go, they go too beyond their limit. That makes me look at you a different way, bro. Like you doing too much. Like what's doing too much though? Like she, was she throwing up or some shit? Like bitches falling and over and shit. Oh. Like can't even walk and shit. Oh like, yeah, my no, god. Call the Uber. <laughs> yeah. Yo, he's like an asshole, bro. <laughs> <laughs> This nigga ass. Nah, bro. Nah, I feel you. I'll do the same shit. I'm not gonna lie, bro. Bro, I was I said, saying, bro. You don't like public attention. I'm the same way, but I don't like public niggas looking at me and shit. Yeah, bro. You trying to like you be you that nigga trying to help you, feel me? And it's not even that serious. Like the conversation we have is not serious, but like she drunk and yelling, so it make it look oh, serious and shit. Oh man. So I was like, yeah. Oh man. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, bro. Nigga, oh man, I, I feel bad for you, bro. I, I, don't, I wouldn't know that. Yeah, I'll probably leave. Bro. I don't regret saying that shit, bro. I'm I'll probably leave, bro. <laughs> nah, you supposed to do that. She's wilding up. Nigga, are you supposed to do that? I think you just say it worse, bro. <laughs> Something like, bro, she's wilding. Yeah, bro. That's some, yeah, hold your liquor, bro. Your bitches know how to hold your liquor, bro. <clears throat> Thanks, bro. Hold your liquor, bro. Don't drink, bro. Know your limits, bro. Nah, word. I nigga, I know that. my limits, bro. I know the fuck I'm supposed to do and what not to do, bro. Nigga, y'all gotta know y'all limits, bro. Nah, fine. Nigga, you think you can hang? Hey, bitches wanna be cool, bro. But I guess, bro. But, um, but, yo, let us know what y'all niggas thinking down below about the topics we talked about right. and shit, man. You feel me? This is a good, another good podcast. Yo, get us up 500 subscribers, 500 man. subscribers. You know what I'm saying? Bye. Bro, stop giving these August. niggas days, bro, because these niggas August, is damn, bro. bro. <laughs> Get us a final subscribe, but y'all niggas take it mad long, bro. <laughs> Hurry up, bro. Yo, follow us also on threads and shit. Bro, we're going to be posting anything and everything, I, I, anything that comes to niggas' mind. We're going to post that right. shit. You want niggas to interact with this shit and shit. Um, follow follow our, 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 our editor and shit. Picasso, John Picasso, uh, follow him on Instagram first. and shit, man. For me, fast, he does fast responses and shit, all that shit, man. Get him, support him and shit, man. But make sure you like, comment, subscribe, man. We out.